Yeah, children. So today we will discuss about heredity and limitation. This is all about the concentrate here, children. So children, I want to start with heredity. Children, what is heredity? This is an old theory. Transfer of characters from parents to offspring. Transfer of characters from parents to offspring is called. Please make your audio all clear. Is called heredity. Try to understand. Children. Transfer of characters from parents to offspring is called heredity. Okay, children. So whenever you study about heredity, immediately you should also study about variations, children. And the story I told about the variations, important about the variations. Variations are slight difference in characters between genetic and okay? parents and offspring. Parents and offspring is called variations. Is called variations. Okay, children. Now only to research, you said trans characters will be transferred. Now only you say that there is <coughs> there is a difference you will be saying. Yes, children. Characters will be transferred. From father, you will get some characters. From mother, you will get some characters. You will get a mixture of characters that is called variations. And variations occurs because of DNA copy. So many times it occurs. Okay, so many times it occurs. Now, children, okay, and this study of heredity, okay, study of heredity and variations and about genes, all these things. Please kind of mute your audios. Don't irritate me. Study of heredity, variations, and genes will study under genetics. Study of gene is called genetics. Study of gene is called genetics. Or you can say study of heredity and variation and genes is called genetics. Who is father of genetics? Who is father of genetics? Yes, children, anyone? Grieger, Johansson, Mendel. Grieger, Johansson, Mendel. Father of genetics is Grieger. Johansson Mendel. Okay. Grieger Johansson Mendel, he worked on which plant? He worked on which plant? He worked on pea plant. Pea plant. Very, very important question. The scientific name of pea plant is Isum sativum. Isum sativum. Okay, children. <coughs> Okay, children, the father of genetics is Greek. He was not a scientist, children. He was just a Christian father, children. He is a Christian monk. Okay, he was just a father in the church, children. He was a father in the church. But uh, he was utmost interested in, in genetics, children. So, breeding techniques, the this. So, he grew a small garden in the back of the church uh, courtyard and he started working on pea plant. Important question Who is the father of genetics? Mind one more question. Um, Mendel worked on which plant? Pea plant. One more question. Why does he select his pea plant only when so many plants are there? Very, 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 very important question. Many times they ask me for it, subject. Why did he select when so many plants are there? Why did he select only pea plant? This is very, very important question. Why did he select a pea plant? Because uh, pea plant has short life span. When is that? It will grow in one week or two weeks or 15 days and one month and it will complete, you can complete the harvest. It won't take uh, six months, one year like my daughter children. You can grow it fast, you can harvest it fast. That's why he selected this. And it can grow in any season. You have to wait for summer, you have to wait for winter, you have to wait for spring and nothing like that. It can grow in any season. And it has, very very important this is, it has Many, many different characteristics are available. Many different characteristics are available. This is very important. Okay? There are so many plants which have these two characters. But specialty is pea plant has many, many different characteristics to do the breeding techniques, to do the breeding experiments. It has different, different characters. Different characters means what, sir? You get that. Like example, tall plants will be there. Short plants will be there, or dwarf plants, or round seeded plants will be there, or wrinkled seeded plants will be there. 
okay children or uh, green color uh, pod is there or yellow color pod is there that the different different characters uh, you will get children in the screen plant because of uh, existing uh, presence of so many different different characters uh, what happens means children he selected pre plant very very important question pre marks question they'll ask this in what is why did mendel select the pre plant because it has short lifespan it can grow in any season it has different characteristics for breeding techniques example it's tall and short round and oval green and l or like this different different characters you will get okay and he extensively worked on pre plant children and he proposed to famous laws mendel's law children one is law of independent assortment Okay, children. One is law of independent assortment, and other one is law of dominance. Law of dominance, and uh, other law is also there. Children like that. He he proposed famous laws. Okay, law of independent assortment, law of dominance, and uh, one more law is there, children. And uh, this he proposed that laws, children. Mono hybrid, and that we will study in tenth class in the form of mono hybrid cross and di hybrid cross, which I will tell you in next class, children. Okay, so now in this class, what did I say? Yes, sir. I told you definition of heredity. One more question: What is heredity? Transfer of characters from parents to offspring is called heredity. Oh, that's all. What is variation? Slight difference in characters between parents and offspring. Slight difference in characters. It should be genetic. Okay, it's called variations. Variations are because of DNA. And <coughs> study of heredity, variation, and genes is called genetics. One more question: Who is father of genetics? G. J. Mendel, Krieger, Johansson, Mendel. Okay, he worked on which plant? Pea plant. Why did he select a pea plant only? Because it has short lifespan and it can grow in any season and it has many many different different characters. What are the different different characters available? Tall and dark plants, round and medium sized plants, green and yellow for, for, uh, color for plants, like the different different varieties you get children. So, based on this, he proposed so many uh, laws children and the class uh, we will study in the form of mono hybrid cross and di hybrid cross. Okay children. The mono hybrid cross and di hybrid cross we will uh, discuss in the next class. Okay, so hey, last uh, uh, last heredity variation study. Who is the father? He worked on which plant? And why did he select a pea plant? Very very important question. In this three points, short lifespan, growing in any season, it has many different characters. This is very important. Okay, children. And uh, G. J. Mendel was the father of uh, genetics. Called considered as father of genetics, children. He was some 18th century scientist, children. He is not a scientist. He is just a Christian father. In uh, because of his own interest, he developed a court yard as a small garden, children. And he started developing so many breeding techniques in Indian children. And because of that, these uh, laws only, children. And because of his techniques only, that was the basis, children, for the breeding techniques which we are following, children. Population is growing. Population is growing. We are able to feed this many people on the earth. How is it possible? Because of the breeding techniques. Because of the breeding techniques, we are able to feed this many people. Whether it is in the form of cross, whether it is fruits, whether it is milk, or whatever it is, we are breeding continuously. We are breeding, interbreeding, artificial breeding, uh, natural uh, like a natural selection, artificial selection. We keep on doing, and we keep on increasing the production. How we are able to produce so much milk? It because of its basis. Uh, which he gave up. Food is important, children. Not technology. Technology, whether it is there or not, we can live. But if food is not there, no one will survive. And you have to really, really appreciate this man. We, even though he's not scientist, out of just interest, in so many, so many experiments, and he gave so many different, different laws for the future generations. Okay, children. All the points are very, very important for tenth class basics. Okay, tenth class questions. Children. Thank you so much. Any have anyone have any doubts? You can ask me.